Hi, I'm John. And this vlog is entitled Pro Feminist Art. But before I get into that, let me give you some background on how I got into supporting pro feminist art. At the time, Deaf Hope's Julie Reams Smario was the executive director of Deaf Hope. She contacted me and we talked about ideas for a PSA vlog to get this message out onto social media networking like Facebook and Twitter to get this very important message about domestic violence out there. So I made my very first domestic violence vlog and here it is. And there was quite a bit of behind the scenes work with these three women. A lot of collaborating and I'm telling you I was it really hit me very hard. I learned so much from them about domestic violence issues, but it wasn't enough. So Julie and I talked about, yes, you know, we should go forward with a lot more vlogs, PSA vlogs, but I knew that I needed to educate myself. I needed to learn more about this issue. That way I could be more effective with the vlogs. And that's just when Deaf Hope offered me this 40-hour domestic violence training. So I took this training, and I'm, I'm telling you, it hit me very hard. It was like a boot camp, not a physical boot camp, but a mental, a heart-touching, emotional boot camp. There with, those, with that group and talking for 40 hours and discussing and training about all these different issues about society privileges and wage disparities and the issues that face women every day, all these points... And I started to see all these red flags in our society and the issues that women deal with. And, and I thought deeply on this issue and I thought about this logo. And that artwork, that logo is very powerful to me. I'm sure it's powerful to some of you out there. And it symbolizes strength to me. And again, I thought long and hard about this. And I thought about the 70s era. NOW organization, the feminist movements. And my first impression was, well, you know, I really can't do anything to support, to lend my support, because I'm, a, I'm not a woman, and I'll never understand what it's like to be a woman. So, therefore, that's that. Nothing I can do. And I, But I thought long and hard about it some more, and I realized, you know, no one deserves to be oppressed. No one deserves to be treated less than, but no one wants to lend their support. They don't want to ask how they can help. So, of course, all that madness, that mindset has to change. So I thought, well, what can I, what can guys like me do to lend our support for feminism, pro-feminism? Well, to lend our support, the more alliances we make, the more changes we can help, we can make in our society. And that's why I was inspired to make this artwork and to lend my hand. I want to thank you all for watching my vlog, and so long.